Welcome back guys to another squad of videos today. This is going to be a squad of the past and present best Arsenal players. Now we're going to run through the bench and reserves and then we're going to run through the actual team. So first of all we do have uh, a legend in David Seaman as you can see there. Uh, the clubs he's played for. Uh, Man City, Arsenal, QPR, Birmingham and Port Peterborough. Uh, as you can see Arsenal for 13 years. Uh, I don't know why I've just come off, but this is a surprising one personally. I didn't actually realise he had played for Arsenal, but uh, after a bit of research, he was in the youth ranks, which is Carlos Vaya of um, Real Sociedad. Um, and I feel like he's, well, Arsenal could really do with a player like him in their squad, and they let him go when he was quite young. Uh, an old player that they used to have is Matthew Upson. Um, he played for them between 2006 and 2008. Um, not really much to say about him. He's an okay centre back back in his day, but he's now playing for MK Dons and 73 rated on FIFA and isn't actually that good. Uh, next is Colo Torre, uh, famous for him and his brother's song at Man City of Yaya. Yeah, yeah, Kolo Tori song, you know, the chant. Everyone should know if they're a football fan. Uh, but yeah, he has uh, now signed for Celtic, but uh, he used to play for Arsenal, which is a, I never realised, and that's uh, a shock to me. We then have another legend, if I, I like the legend profile tab. You can see there, just underneath Real Madrid, Arsenal, he played for them for a year, and that is Davor Suka. Okay, person, really. I don't really know much about him, so move on. To Alex Song, now plays for uh, Ruben Kazan in Russia. Uh, went to West Ham, uh, then got loaned, no, went to Barcelona, got loaned to West Ham. West Ham brought him, and now he's gone to uh, Ruben Kazan in Russia. Uh, this is a current player in Aaron Ramsey, uh, performed amazingly at the Euros and he's a good player that Arsenal have. Getting on to the reserves then, we have Jens Lehmann, um, another legend and as you can see he played for Arsenal for 5 years and uh, was an important part of the mm, defeatables I believe, not too sure. but. Uh, on to another youth player that they let go in Johan Juru. Um, played amazing for Switzerland at the Euros. He was a rock in defence. And he's a kind of defender. I don't think Arsenal are missing him, but I mean, he is a good asset to have in your squad. And then next is Emmanuel Fring Pong. Um, I'm not too sure when he played for Arsenal, but I do know he's quite famous uh, in Arsenal fans' hearts. Like uh, he was like a, um, I'd say he was like a Will Rig of that time. Not actually good, but the fans cheered him on a lot. And Will Grigg isn't really that good, but Northern Irish fans do overrate him a lot. Uh, moving on to Jovino who now plays in China, but uh, once had a spell um, at um, Arsenal, obviously. But that, what surprised me when I was searching him is his actual name is not actually Jovino. It's G Gervas Yo Kuase, and there's no Jovino in that. There's Jovia, like Jovine, like the start of it, but they're not Enio. So he's obviously just put Enio onto it just to make a nickname. And then to complete the reserves is Michael, Michael, Mikel Arteta, he used to play for Everton, I think he's now part of the Everton uh, training staff for Ronald Kerman, and has uh, retired, but I thought it would be nice to put him in there. And that is the bench and uh, reserves done, let's get into the team. So in goal, we have Petr Cech. Um, ex Chelsea uh, striker, ex Chelsea goalkeeper, legend, um, 
uh, why Chelsea let him go to Arsenal, I don't know. But since joining Arsenal, he's proved to be still an amazing keeper. And he's part of the reason why Arsenal did perform so well last season. Uh, right back, I couldn't really think of an ex-right back that they had uh, and searching up. So I put in Hector Bellerin, who's an up-and-coming prospect. Uh, he's only 21, so he's got a huge potential ahead of him. Uh, next to him is another current Arsenal player in Laurent Koscielny. Beast of a defender on his day. And I feel like um, he is... He's 31 now, so he's getting to his prime, I'd say, and he'll probably start dropping off quite soon. Next is uh, Sol Campbell. A lot of controversy in this uh, transfer. As you can see there, his top two teams that he's played for are Spurs and Arsenal, who are major North London rivals. And I believe he went to Spurs, was it, for free? I'm sure, no, he went from Spurs to Arsenal for free and he ran down his contract. He was refusing to sign his contract and then he went to Arsenal for free and was part of the undefeatable squad. I know that one for sure. Then we also have an ex-Chelsea player in uh, Ashley Cole. Uh, Chelsea signed him from 